Today is Saturday, April 22nd, and it's record store day. Going to check out the local record store called Common Beat and see if they have anything interesting for record store day. And I'm gonna go to the park, listen to my audiobook, maybe read a little bit. Um, but I wanted to take you guys along. It's been a couple weeks since I did like a vlog style video, so I have some random footage from a karaoke party that we went to. What else? Oh, going to Longwood Gardens with Joe, my boyfriend's family. I'm going to put that all together into something and hope you enjoy it. Here we are at Longwood Gardens in Kennett Square, Pennsylvania. In these clips, you'll see my boyfriend Joe, my dear friends Christian and Julie, and their daughter Margaret, Joe's parents Pam and Rick, and his sister Becca as well. The flowers were absolutely stunning, and it was exceptionally hot for April 13th. I can't believe it's spring already. It feels like time moves faster every year. This winter was really difficult for me, but seeing the city transform out of its phase of hibernation is giving me hope to power through. The gray, cold, and dreary days are few and far between now. Sometimes even when the sun is out, I still feel winter inside my head, lingering. A trip through Longwood Gardens was really what I needed that day. I have been navigating my way through a funk that's left me feeling incredibly uninspired and overly judgmental about the progress, or lack thereof, I've made since the end of 2022. But maybe I just need to shift my perspective on what growth can look like. Oh, is it Give him some sweet pats. Where's Raina? There's Raina. Oh, What's her name? Can you say Raina? Can you say Raina? <laughs> no. <laughs> what? You want the Joe the cheese for you? I cannot get over how cute this baby is. I love her. Yeah, Becca. 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 Hey, Margaret. Hey, Margaret. Where's Raina? Hey, Margaret, where's Becca? Oh, Yay! Yay! I feel so privileged! Where's Dad Dad? Yay! Hi, bud. Hey, where are you going? Is it a, what kind of knot is it? Do you know? Where are you going? Wait, what? I just, I just found it. Oh, I thought you meant Becca tied it. Oh, no! Oh! We're making our way into the massive greenhouse here. During the holiday season, the gardens string up all kinds of lights throughout the whole property, and it's truly incredible. It's almost as good as Rainforest Cafe, man. Beautiful. Almost as good as Rainforest Cafe. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hydrangeas are one of my favorite flowers, and they had just the most beautiful ones here. I mean, look at them. Stunning. Red bud. Is this called a white bud? <laughs> That's called a fritillary. Maybe focus a little less on the goats, Joe. Okay, copy and, that. Uh, a little more on Raina. Copy that. Mm -hmm. Places, everyone. 
Reset. <laughs> Back to one. Back to one. After a few hours in the hot sun, we are ready to cool off and get some dinner. It was such a pleasure to see all of the spring blossoms in one place. If you haven't been here before, I highly recommend a day trip to Longwood Gardens. It this is, is like fantastic. It's time to go home, back to the city. This next clip is from the following day, celebrating the first of three birthdays in this video. If you're looking for a fun time, karaoke in Chinatown is where you want to go. It was a blast. <laughs> Oh, it's Bojangles playing with a bug in the park. Oh. Hi. At the beginning of this year, I got this piano and I've been playing some scales and so far I know two songs. So, so far so good. <laughs> About a week and a half ago, I made a pact to myself to actively try to meditate every day and I have downloaded this app called Waking Up and so far I really like it. The app itself is really easy to use and they have a bunch of different courses you can try. Um, I've been having really bad anxiety and I have found that this has been helping a little bit. So give it a whirl if you haven't. We made it to record store day. Unfortunately, Common Beat didn't have anything special going on, but I did find a cute present for Margaret. I've had my guitars set up here as well, and they do a great job if you're looking for a shop in West Philly. Great record selection. Highly recommend. This is the album that I bought for my friend's baby, baby Margaret. She turned one few weeks ago and we're having a birthday party with all of our friends tomorrow so but this is so cute happy birthday to you happy birthday dear Rachel. happy How cute this baby's birthday party was. Julie and Christian did such a great job setting everything up. I helped a little bit. And the weather was absolutely perfect. Look at that cake. Margaret's got a small one that she's going to dig into after. Oh, I love it. Hello, you two. I've been running. Yeah. Howdy. How's it going? Good. How are you? Great to see you too. Football games, even though. Yeah, I think we're gonna grill a couple of times. Oh, sweet. Oh, yeah, bring some food. Hi, Margaret. You got, oh, you got the, you got a track in there. Oh, wow. Who brought that? Oh, that was She's cleaning. What are you doing? Mommy's teaching her well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Margaret. What do you have? Are you coming to see me? <laughs> You're coming to see me? Can you stand up? Are you going to walk to me? Aww. She's got a bunch of animal noises. There you go. Margaret around. Margaret, what does the chicken say? What's the chicken say? Oh, yes! It does! <laughs> no, I'm, I'm like, close and personal with Margaret! 
that Sunti? What is it that? This, this is Pim's. Oh, okay. Pim's and uh, simple syrup and lemon juice. I saw my neighbors making sun tea the other day. You don't have to pour me a whole cup so everybody okay. can have some. Yeah. Okay. How fun. What is the taste of Pim's just by itself? Kind of like a little like licorice -y. Okay. Yeah. You got a few of those. That was just. Oh, the whole spray. Twig. Let's see if I can do it. But after a while, I was like, damn, I kind of like it. Start. <laughs> hey, you bartender. There you go. Bartender! Hey, Sandor. How are you? Oh, please do. Please grab a cookie. Oh, shit. That's fire. Is it good? Have you tried it yet? Not really. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's so good. Hey, Justin, what's up, dog? How you doing, man? Hot dogs. It smells like up dog. Hey, what's up, dog? <laughs> Nothing much. Oh, Looks yeah. like oh, I have to have this card. Bad. Hey, got him. Got, got. Got, got, dude. So the warmer weather and, like, the ability to do stuff like this. Happy birthday. Just enjoy the moment. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Can you blow? Blow, blow the candle. No. Grab it. Yeah. We'll have a raspberry. Yay! Yay! Where's your raspberry? Now what? Go, girl. Yeah. It's like a press conference. Joe, you're the shot. You're the shot, Joe. Dang it. Oh, no. Get the raspberry. Get the raspberry. Smash that! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Do it! Yeah! <laughs> you can get it. You want to pick it up? Grab that cake. Pick it up. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Aww. Good job! <laughs> and that's a wrap yeah. on Margaret's first birthday. Yeah. 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 Everybody else is going yeah. to work They're finally attacking. <laughs> Today is April 25th, Tuesday. I am going to New York City to see my sister, and we are going to see John Williams, the composer, and orchestra. I love going to New York City in the spring and I don't usually get up to see my sister very much so I'm really excited and looking forward to it. We're gonna get all dressed up and I want to show you what springtime in Manhattan feels like. See you there. I'm starting to notice things I wouldn't have otherwise with a camera in my hand. Moving slower and observing my surroundings. I've been to 30th Street Station a bunch of times and never took a second to actually look at this incredible sculpture on the wall. Travel makes me incredibly anxious. I think I have an endless fear of getting from point A to B on time and safely. Living in Philadelphia for eight years now has made it a little easier, but it's still nerve wracking nonetheless. The event was at the new David Geffen Hall at Lincoln Center with the New York Philharmonic. Steven Spielberg was co-hosting the event, and it was fancy. Are you excited to see all of the music? <laughs> oh, you're talking? Okay. Yes. <laughs> Last spring, my sister Ashley and I went to see John Williams conduct a whole concert of his work at Carnegie Hall. 
One big difference of the two shows was the use of movie clips while the orchestra was playing. Stephen did a comparison of the tomb scene from Indiana Jones Raiders of the Lost Ark with and without music, and it's so clear that music makes the biggest difference in a film. My favorite piece to hear that night was probably the Jurassic Park theme. It is my favorite movie from when I was a kid. So fun. The next day, we took a very, very long walk around Central Park during the afternoon. We must have walked like nine miles. My feet were killing me. I think I got shin splints. Not the greatest. Still had a nice time. <laughs> the tulips, trees, and the tourists were out in full force. This is the Jackie Kennedy Reservoir up in the middle of the park. Really lovely to walk around. Peaceful. This tree was just raining petals. Gorgeous. Had to take it in, breathe in the fresh air. While we were walking around, I was kind of wishing that there were labels on some of the plants and trees to identify them. These flowers had the prettiest little star buds. I really wanted to go to the Met and see some great art, but it's closed on Wednesdays. So that was a big disappointment and they were setting up for the Met Gala, which is happening on May 1st. These pigeons, these pigeons were so cute. So instead of going to the Met, we decided to go to the Central Park Zoo. My sister Ashley had never been to the zoo before, which deeply surprised me because she's lived in Manhattan for so many years. Oh my God, these penguins. These penguins were so cute. <laughs> Listen to this lady next to me. They were just so cute. Something about going to the zoo makes you feel like a kid again. I think this is the wonder of animals you don't get to see every day, like grizzly bears. Every person there had a huge smile on their face. It was really sweet to see. I love them all. They are so cute. One time I went to the Philadelphia Zoo for my birthday in the middle of summer in July. And something about it made me really depressed. <laughs> I think it might have been the very sad polar bear lying in the extreme heat with flies buzzing around its eyes. <laughs> Anyways. Oh my god. I, can't hear that. I feel like the only places that you see these machines are at aquariums and zoos. Cute. They should have these everywhere. They're great. I was in desperate need of a coffee at this point in the day. It must have been like 4.30. Ashley wanted to go somewhere fancy, so here we go. The fanciest. <laughs> and we wrapped up our super long walk with a trip to this amazing guitar store. I bought a new tremolo pedal by a small company called Native Audio. I think I'll make a video of me trying it out. Would you guys want to see that? Thank you so much for joining me through this very long but fun vlog, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.